Okay, people have been asking for it. It's time. I've decided to not be quite as pissy with the snapper. I'm going to try and get it to run again. Um, status report. Uh, all the hydraulic fluid is settled to the bottom of everything. So uh, you have to turn the wheel back and forth a bunch of times before the steering works. Um, we got it to turn over. There is no spark. But that's... That's not a surprise. Um, we'll forget in a second. Because the points don't have their cover on them. And I don't know how y'all can see this, but... Um, yeah, there's no light. But they're, they're gross. Uh, we're gonna change the carburetor. I got a new one. Right there. Um... Do a new battery in it. Well, said my name. Tire won't hold air. Tire back there was flat. Tire over there is flat. This one's got a bad valve stem. Um, the uh, recall they did, where they gave you the free starter rebuild system, that's dead. I don't think there's getting any power to it. We just jump right over the relay. Uh, I think the starter switches are bad because. The headlights used to not work and now they're stuck on, even though the switch is off. Uh, and uh, that's that's going to be pretty much it for right now. Updates as they come. Okay, update number one. We have torn into the motor, gotten the intake manifold off, and the carburetor, the offending carburetor. Um, I think we're going to reuse the carburetor gaskets or the intake gaskets, seeing as how they're pretty much mint. Uh, we popped off the valve covers. Um, I, uh, how would you describe what they look like in there? Uh, beautiful. Beautiful, Very yes. Beautiful. Uh, we'll pop this out for a second. We used our Windex aid to clean it up real good. Yeah, you can see down here the valves are kind of blued, but uh, all in all it's clean down in there. Uh, exhaust side's dirty as hell. Uh, everything is coming apart well. Um, we broke one bolt right there, if you can't tell. Not going to worry about dealing with it, just holds on a cover. Uh, found out the points. I, I can finally show y'all, I think. One second. Uh, yeah, you can. Look at those points. Those are f fudged. Okay. First update, thank you. And now it, it runs. I'm gonna need you to hold this, turn the key back to on. You can try to start it with the switch? No, it's not gonna start. As, as I said. They have a lot of electrical starting problems. And we're getting a really bad connection at this broken, stupid socket. So. A new super start battery on it from your local O'Reilly store with from a one year your local warranty. local O'Reilly with a limited one year warranty. Uh, if anybody's wondering what size battery fits in a John Deere 318, it's a 26R. I was gonna say R Eco, but you can fit any kind of 26 a, a 26R series. Put a new fuel line on it, new carburetor, new spark plugs. Uh, we're missing the air cleaner, so we'll have to find one of those. Guys.